the show now is our friend from PointsBet, senior editor Teddy Greenstein. Teddy, good to have you with us. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the lines and where we can expect things here for week number one. Uh, week one, the Rams giving seven points, the over-under at 45. So where are we supposed to bet on this first Sunday night of the NFL season? Well, Catherine, I live just a few miles from Soldier Field, so I consider myself an expert on crummy quarterback play. <laughs> and since Aaron Rodgers has been in Green Bay, since he's really taken over since 2008, the Bears have used 14 different starters. And, of course, they enter this season with so many question marks. Andy Dalton is the week one starter. 99% of the fan base wants Justin Fields. And that uncertainty is part of why I like the Rams here. I think they have a huge advantage at quarterback with Matthew Stafford. Now, I will say this as well. If you like the Rams, flock to points bet here because a lot of books have this line at seven and a half, seven in the hook in betting parlance. We have it at seven points. What's unusual about that is it has not budged since our line came out in May. Even though 80% of the money we're taking on this game so far has been on the Rams. So our traders are baiting you into betting on the Rams, and I will take that. <laughs> okay, I like it. I like that. All right, you know, Teddy, we always love a flair for the dramatic. What are some of the season exotics that you're going to be looking at? Yeah, so the exotics are really fun unless you are a fan of one of the teams uh, <laughs> that might be the last to register a win, and that's what we're going to start at here. So the Lions are favored at plus 250. The Texans are at plus 350. And we have a whole mess of teams at plus 1,000. Now, the Texans open at home against the Jaguars. So even if you're not a huge Tyrod Taylor guy, I think you have to pass on that team. The Lions certainly have the schedule to win this bet when you look at the schedule of 49ers, Packers, Ravens, and then at Chicago, at Minnesota. I am going to take my beloved New York Jets at plus 1,000 at 10 to 1 sort of going for a reverse jinx effect here. Now, the Jets play the Falcons week five, but maybe by then the Lions will have shocked the world. All right, a Jets fan living in Chicago. We'll get to that another episode down the road. But, <laughs> Teddy, NFL kickoff, Dallas Cowboys at the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. The game line, the Bucs currently seven and a half point favorites, over under at 50 and a half. What are you thinking about this? Yeah, now I hate to be a total goober and go with the favorites, like so many amateur bettors do, while the... Uh, more, you know, experienced betters talk about the value in the underdogs, but but here we are. Now, before we get to my pick, I do have to tell you about one thing. Juice. So the juice is basically the tax that sports books put on these games. And the standard wager is minus 110. You wager $110 to win 100. At points bet, for the entire month of September, we are offering no juice lines. They are going to be posted 48 hours before kickoff. That means you bet 100 to win 100. Pretty extraordinary. Now, in this case, I am going for the favorites for the Bucs because of a couple trends. One, the Cowboys were the worst spread team in the NFL last year. They went 5-11, and 11, always overvalued. And two, the defending Super Bowl champion. This is pretty remarkable. 14-6-1 against the number since 2000. I think you'll recall a year ago, the Chiefs covered in their opener against the Texans. It's not a great favorite. So I think there's too much uncertainty in Big D with Dak Prescott and his shoulder, and the Bucs are so solid. Nearly the same roster that dominated the Chiefs in the Super Bowl last year. That's good enough for me. Yeah, which is kind of scary if you think about it. All right, Teddy, we look forward to having you on and uh, always breaking things down for us. The NFL season is almost here, and the NBC Sports Predictor app has you covered. Sunday Night 7 is free to play with a $100,000 jackpot up for grabs every week. You can download today from your app store or visit NBCSports.com slash predictor. Hi, I'm Mike Tirico, and thanks for watching. Make sure to hit subscribe for the latest news and highlights from NBC Sports.